Now that the file is set up properly, we'll create the bottom portion of the clamshell. From this point forward, we'll refer to it as the CPU case. In the basic palette, double click the rounded rectangle tool. This will open the Create Object dialog box. Input 15 and 1 12th for the width and 10 and 1 12th for the height. Be sure Position at Next Click is checked and choose Symmetrical from the Corner drop down menu. Also set the Diameter X and Diameter Y fields to 1 inch and then click OK. Since Position at Next Click was checked, you will need to click somewhere near the origin, 00, zero to create the rounded rectangle. This rounded rectangle is the overall size of the CPU case. Now let's add some depth. Go to the standard views menu in the view bar and choose right isometric. From the 3D modeling tool set, select the push pull tool. Be sure the first mode, extrude face, is enabled in the toolbar. Move the pointer toward the center of the rounded rectangle. Once the rounded rectangle is highlighted, click to begin extruding the rounded rectangle face. You should notice the pointer has changed to a double-headed arrow. Now press the tab key to enter the distance field in the floating data bar and input 3 eighths. Press enter to lock in the value. Then click anywhere on the drawing area to create the extrude. 